Babe, are you awake? GM, and yes, you woke me up. Oh, I'm sorry. You should be. Can we play something? No, I'm playing. With who? With my friends. Can I join? Only if you stay quiet. Okay. Miles is my name added Lana XD to the GC. Uh, who's this? My annoying girlfriend. Hi, my name is Leah. Shut up. Apology. Let's do name age and face reveal. Okay. I'm first, I'm Jade, I'm 16, and this is me. They all say pretty. I'm Leah. I'm 16 too, and this is me. Pretty. Ugly. Bro, shut up, Leah. You're gorgeous. Ty, guys. Okay, so I am Brian. I'm 17, and this is me. Hot. I mean, cute. Thanks, princess. Ayo, back off my girl. I didn't know that you actually cared about Leah. Me neither. Okay, so? Anyways, I'm Miles, I'm 17, and this is me. We don't care anyways. I'm Alice, I'm 15, and this is me. Girl, marry me. Haha, <laughs> thank you, Jade. Okay, so y'all want to play Dowhood? Sure, but can I give you some Robux, Leah? Oh my god, I mean if you want to. L, Ja has given 200,000 Robux to Leah XD. Oh my god, Ty. I'll go change. How do I look? Beautiful. Beautiful. What about you, Miles? You, you are a preppy girl. Um, yay? You change your outfit now. People can't see me with a preppy girl. Wth, Miles. That's it, I'm breaking up with you. Because of you, my best friend is mean to me. Oh, I'm sorry, Miles. Don't be Leah, you haven't done anything wrong. Shut up, Alice. She has. No, she has not. Leah, you little. Miles is my... Name has been kicked from the GC. Uh, why was he always so rude to everyone? Wait, he was rude to all of you too? Sadly, yes. But why though? We honestly don't know. Then, let's find out. At the same time with Miles. Ugh, I hate Leah. Let me just text my other girlfriend. Hi, babe. Yeah, yeah, hi. Did something happen? Yeah, my crazy ex stole my friends. And when I said the truth, he didn't believe me. Oh, I'm sorry, my love. Do you want me to talk to her? If you want to, but she's crazy. Don't worry, I got it. If you say so. Okay, so what's her user, my love? It's Leah XD. Okay. Hey, you. Huh, me? Yes, you dumb. Stay away from my boyfriend, got it? May I ask who is your boyfriend? Miles and don't play dumb? I already know what you did. Oh, what did he say I did? You stole his friends, don't play innocent. I didn't he lied to you. Why would I believe you? Shows proof. Oh, this liar. I'm so sorry. I didn't know that he lied. It's fine. Can we be friends? Sure. Okay, great. By the way, my name is Elenine. But you can't call me Elena. Okay, my name is Leah. I was wondering if you want to join my GC. Okay. Leah XD added Elena XOXO to the GC. Who's this? Hi, I'm Elena, and I'm Miles' ex. Why are you here? Explains everything. Oh. Okay, Leah, do you want to match your fits? Sure. Wow, lovebirds. Ugh, anyways, who's that hottie? I'm Brian, and please don't. Call me hottie. I have a crush. Oh, okay. Anyways, be right back. At the same time with Elenine. Babe, come online. What is it? Our plan is working. Good, now try to get some Robux from Leah. Okay, babe. In private chat with Leah. Leah, can I have some Robux, please? Uh, sure, Iggy. Give Robux? Okay, bye. Not even thank you? I'll go spy on her. Did you got Robux? Yes, love. Good. So she's using me, and she's still with Miles. I'm going to tell others. Guys? What happened, babe? I, I mean, Leah. Elena is using me, and she is still together with Miles. Oh my god. But why? I think Miles wants revenge and Elena helps him. What are we going to do to now? Let's pretend it first and then confess her. Okay. Hey guys, I'm back. Okay, so who wants to play to hood? They all say me. Okay, let's play then. They play for three hours. That was fun. Yay. Guys, should we tell her? Okay. We know that you are still with Miles and you are using me. H how? I was spying on you. 
please I can. Alina, XOXO has been kicked. Good that she is gone. Okay. Guys, can I add my girl BSF? They all say sure. Lucia, Mummy has been added to the GC. What's up, Momas? What? Oh, shut up, you look like stupid. That's why you don't have friends and family. I can write a whole book about you. Why so mean, beastie? You stupid, what are those emojis? Look like an idiot with those. And I'm not your old beastie. I like this girl. Oh, you must be Leah, a.k.a. Brian's girl. No, I'm not his girl. Oh, he talks a lot about you. Shush, Lucia. What goofy, am I not allowed to say that? Yes. Oh, anyways, yeah, he likes you. Okay, but can you do face reveal? Sure, Mommy. You look beautiful. Thanks, baby. Why are you acting like all the girls in this GC are your GFS? Because I want to, you idiot. Can I add someone? Sure, BBG. Darwin is very cool has been added to the GC. Hello. Oh, you have British accent. So is it a problem? No, it's hot, you dummy. Oh. Stop scaring this boy, Lucia. Shut up, I didn't ask. What's your name, British boy? I Darwin. Okay, anyways, I don't know these. Two girls named So Tell Your Names? Jade. Alice. Face. Cute. Marry me, Alice. Ha ha, Ty Lucia. Bye, guys. I gotta go eat. Brian, tell Leah how you feel right here and now. Okay, fine, beastie. Leah, I have something to tell you. What is it? I like you since we met. Ah, uh, I have to think about it. It's okay. Come on, let's be honest you like Brian too. Yes, I like him. Then why do you have to think about it? I don't know. Ask him, Brian. Leah, do you want to be my girlfriend? Yes. Yay, my BSF finally got a girlfriend. Now, how can I get a girlfriend? You're a lesbian? No, but wait, Darwin, can you show your face? Okay. Nice, Alice, are you single? Yes, why? Just wondering. Kind of sus. Shut up, you goofy British boy. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go, guys. At the same time, with Jade. Guys, come online. What? what? I think I should tell them that I'm with you guys. Okay. okay. Back in the GC. Okay, I have something to tell you, y'all. I have been friends with Elena and Luca the whole time. And now I'm leaving this group. Jade! Lol has left the GC. I can't believe she was the Therians the whole time. Same. I don't know what is going on. But I don't want this depressed emotion. So can I add me, Lil Sis? By the way, she is seven. Sure, add her. Preppy, Loveroo has been added to the GC. Hello. Hello, can you say your name age and show your face? Sure. I'm Meredith, I'm seven, and this is me. Beautiful. Beautiful. Few years pass. Guys, I got Robux, I'm gonna change. How do I look? Cool. cool. Guys, should we meet in real life? They all say yes. But first, let's do FaceTime. Because we haven't seen each other's faces in a while. In fest time. Wow, babe, you look handsome. Thank you, love. Meredith, you have changed so much. Aw, oh, thank you. You look beautiful as always, Alice. Ah, oh, wow, thanks, Lucia. Alice, can you leave for a minute? Uh, sure. Guys, I think I have a crush on Alice. Shut up, Goofy. So what are you going to do? I think I'm going to ask her. To be my girlfriend when we meet. Good idea. Okay, let's end the call now. What took you so long, guys? Um, nothing. Uh, okay, anyways, where do y'all live? I live in London. We know British boy. I live in California. Same. Oh, I live in Los Angeles. Me and Meredith live in Los Angeles, too. Okay, so where are we gonna meet? Maybe in California? Okay, I'm gonna book my ticket then. Same here. Let's book it the same plane, Alice. Okay, but what about Meredith? Meredith, too. Okay, and I'm gonna go. Same, Same here. here. So do you want to come over to mine? Sure, love. At Leah's house. Coming? Hi, babe. Hi, love. So do you want to watch a movie? Sure, on Netflix. Okay. At the same time with others. Ah, uh, I'm so nervous. 
You're gonna be fine. Hi, guys. Hi, Alice. So are y'all ready to go? Mm, no, Laura has something to say to you. What is it, Laura? Will you be my girlfriend, Alice? Oh, my God, yes. They hug. Okay, let's go to the plane now. They all say okay four hours later, and they land. Okay, let me text the group that we are here. Hi, guys, we made it. Okay, but what about Darwin? I'm in the airport right now. I just got off the plane. Okay, come to my house. My address is Krusty Peppa 45. Connor, Connor, please respond quickly. This is important. Connor, I have to tell you something, Connor. Jamie, where did you go? Why can't I find your profile anymore? It's okay, you can tell me when you get back. I will wait for you. Oh, wow, my old Roblox account is still active. I remember when I used to spend way too much of my time here. Lol, those were good times, though. Ha ha hum, what's this? Old messages. Ha ha ha, I can't believe. I used to actually use Roblox to text people. Huh, oh my god, Connor. I remember him. He was my best friend back in 2017. I wonder if he still plays this game. I've missed him, let's see. Oh, wow. He does still play. He's also online, maybe I should join him. It'll be nice to see him again. Aha, Connor, stop. Oh, my God. Your friend, it's Janie123, has joined the experience. The hell? What? Oh. Nothing. Wow. Just some random friend joined me probs added them by mistake law. Oh, okay, haha. Does, Does he, he not, not remember, remember me? me? Connor? Mm. Babe? Why is a bacon girl <laughs> calling your name? I have no clue. Connor! Hi, do you remember me? Um, yes. Really? No. Oh, it's Janie. We used to be best friend back in 2019. Girl. Ha! Huh. Babe. Let's just go. Yay. I'll meet you in the group chat. Okay. Is it really you? Yes, Connor. It's me. It's Janie. It's Janie. K. What? What? Nothing. I just thought you'd be more excited. Huh, maybe you should lower your expectations a bit. Yeah, maybe I'm just back in the game and all the memories come back make me excited. Look, Janie, it's been almost six years since you left. And you never even said why you just disappeared. If you want, I guess I could argue to the group chat with my friends and maybe we can close again. Maybe that can help you get used to the game again. Um, okay, sure. I can join the group chat. Okay. You should have seen it, Max. It was so pathetic, LMAO. Babe? Finally, you're back up, ugh. How'd it go with the 2019 chick? Yeah, about that. I'm gonna ask her to the group chat. Oh, you know her? Yeah, it's six years ago, though. God, finally, you're online. Only because you guys cannot shut up for five hours. Anyways, what's going on? Connor gonna add a chick he knew six years ago to our group chat. Um, what? I know. Whatever. Just let me add her for a bit. Sure, I don't care. Connor has added Janie to the group. Hi, um, hello? Okay, let's not be rude, please everyone introduce yourself. Maddie, Connor's girlfriend. Nyla. Max. And you already know me? Or so she says. LMAO. Let's be nice, please. Hmm. Um, well, I'm Janie, nice to meet you all. Okay, I'm gonna go offline for a bit. CYA. God, she is obnoxious. Maddie, can you not just be nice for one second, all of you? You weren't talking to her either. Whatever. I don't like her. Me neither, LMAO and the Avatar. Guys, come on. Maybe you should be nicer to her. She seems sweet. God, you sound like Connor. Shut up. Oh my god, haha, he totally does. Hey, babe. Hey, what were you guys talking about? Janie lol. Nothing bad, though. We're talking about her Avatar. She should change it. Fur. It's so outdated. Yeah, I guess you're all right. Hi, guys. I'm back. Oh, joy. Huh. Never mind. Um, so Janie. Yes, Connor. We were talking and we think maybe it's time for an avatar change. Oh, I'm okay, I guess. Watch it look like absolute gross. Nyla. Guys, be nice. Mark, you're so quiet. I'm just watch it. Oh, okay. Is this good? LMAO, stop, no, no. I'm a good person, I swear. Girl, the gold wash to make it better. This is actually killing me, oh my god. Nyla FS, leave her alone. Bro, look at her, she's a laughing stock. Did you not get what we meant? LMAO girl, like it's worse than the other bass. 
Sorry, I don't really have any Robux left over, so I just used the stuff I already had. I can give you some Robux. Here. 50k to Jane. Wow. Thank you so much, Connor. No worries. Some Robux. What? 50,000 Robux is a fact load. She'll use it more than me. Or maybe she'll use you. What? Nothing. Watch her avatar. Shut up, N-Y-L-A. How about this? Hello, guys. What's that, Mom? I'm playing. N-Y-L-A? What the hell? No, she ate that up, B-Tubio. Oh, haha, -ha, thank you. You look good, Mikasa. Mikasa? You used to call you that, remember? Oh my god, yes, Ofk. Haha. <laughs> nice avatar, I guess. Yeah, it's cute. Oh, haha, -ha, thanks, guys. Um... So do you guys want to play game? Okay. Yeah, sure. Okay. Join me all. I'm not going first. Well, I'm not. Bastard. How am I a bastard when I say it? But you're not. You go first, Jane. There is no way in hell that I am going down that dark hallway first. Then you go Max. Okay. Oh, so he's brave brave. A Max Ohelna. I'm out. NYLA, don't leave without me. Come on out, scaredy cat. No. Fine, then stay here alone. Doesn't matter to me. Jane, I do not leave me here. Jane. Oh, oh God, God no. no. Jane. Stalker. Can we hold for a second before the others catch up? Sure, what's up? I just when you left me on 2019. Oh, yeah. I'm so sorry about that. I tried to tell you why I had to leave, but never mind. You can tell me. You know I'm here for you. It's actually not even a big deal. Tell me? Well. Connor, you are so good at jailbreak. Thank you, Jane. Do you want to change and be police now? Janie, why aren't you replying Janie? Sorry, my mom. Just talk to me. She is mad at, at me. Why? She thinks you are an old man. Hi, Janie, your mom is so funny. She said she will take my iPad away if I talk to you. She said she will take my iPad away if I talk to you. Oh, no. Don't worry, Connor. I will style your friend. I do not care what she says. You are my bestie. Pinky promise. Ah, ha, ha, yes. Pinky promise. That was a lie. What? Yep. But why? So what really happened? My mom is going to make me delete my Roblox account regardless. But I can't tell Connor because he will be so sad. Janie, what are you doing? Nothing, Mom. You better not play that stupid game again. I told you to delete the game. Besides, that guy could be an old man. Do you hear me? I shouldn't have given you the iPad. Yes, Mommy. Janie, do you want to be a police now? Sure, Connor. So, yeah. Like I said, it's not a big deal. Why didn't you tell me? It was kind of embarrassing. Yeah, but you just left without saying anything. And when I went to check your profile, it wasn't available. My mom found out Roblox was still downloaded and she account. When I was trying to tell you what was happening, I was talking to you from my mom's computer. She's deleted the account before I could find. Oh, okay. Thanks for telling me, Janie. Sure. Babe? We were looking for you guys everywhere. Sorry. We took a wrong tour right now. That's okay. Simp. Nyla, shut up. Are you cheating on me? What? Will you two be so close at least Jane has some common sense? Do you even still love me? Don't be ridiculous. Of course I do. So then why are you suddenly treating me different? I'm not. Whatever. Maddie. Lex. Well, that was... Something. Yeah. Imagine if they run into the monster mid-argument. Monster kill. kill, kill Karma. Kill, kill. Watch it come back. Ha! Don't worry. I'll protect you, scaredy cat. Monster Maddie, kill. Maddie, I'm not cheating on you with Janie. That's ridiculous. So then why the hell have you two been inseparable lately? You're totally going behind my back to be with her. True. Nila, shut up. This doesn't even consar it now, you. Don't talk to her like that. Cry about it. Look who's back. I wonder what y'all were up to. You sure took a long time. Aha, we were just talking. Face reveal. What? Everyone do a face reveal or you're kicked from the chat. I'm not comfortable showing my facker. Then we'll kick you, princess. No biggie. Maddie, what's wrong with you? 
I'll go first. So pretty. Stunning. You're beautiful, baby. Pretty. Thanks. Me next. Wow, you're so gorgeous. You're pretty. Nice. I wish I looked like you. Oh, thank you, guys. Me now, Edge. Whoa. Rose Majestic. Nice. Jane. Hmm. You're dumb, girl. Anyways, your turn now, Connor. Okay. Pretty. Nice. Handsome man. Nice. Oh, nice. You heard me? Okay. Your turn now, Jane. Hmm. LMAO props a catfish. Sorry. I'm just insecure about how I look. God, get over yourself. Show us four. We're kicking you. Maddie, calm down. Whatever. Here's my face. Pretty. You're so pretty. Mid. If she's mid, you're nothing. Keep your mouth shut. You're so beautiful, Jane. Thank you, guys. Connor DM me. Okay. What? You said Janie was pretty. So what? She is. Wow. What? Nothing. Lex. You're too close with Janie. Maddie, we haven't seen each other since 2019. She's all over you. Give it a rest. Then you're single. What? Me or her? Why do you I have to choose? This is stupid. This shouldn't be hard choice. She's my best friend. She's a snake. Don't talk about her that way. You hardly know her. Don't start with this girl BSF Connor. What? Girls only become your BSF when they want to get closer to you. My God, just leave it be. Congrats. On what? On being single. Okay, fine. Fine. I'll block her. Good. Hey, Janie. Oh, hey, Connor. You're done talking to Maddie? Um, um, so anyways. Hmm? I'm sorry. Lol for what? Um, Connor, hello. Are you getting these? Hmm. Maybe it's a glitch or something. I'll check the group chat. Um, hello. Why aren't my messages sending? Connor, why did you say sorry? What kind of sick prank this? It's not done, EG, guys. I'll call Max. He'll tell me. Max. Jane, hey. You sound surprised. Ha ha, I am. Why? Well, Connor said you wanted to leave the group chat because you weren't comfortable being in. So I was surprised you reached out to me. I didn't think Hello, you'd want to talk. What? Are you ready what? To order? But I didn't want yes. to leave. I Connor messaged me saying sorry. And then my message okay. stopped sending to Let's him and the chat. Moment. Oh, damn. He must block you then. What? But why would he block me, HM? My guess would probably be something to do with Maddie. Oh. So are you going to block me too then? Never. Really? Ever. It's okay. It won't make me upset. Jane. Like, I totally get it, and it's fine if... Jane. I'm not going to block you now. The group chat is playing Roblox right now. I'm going to join them. Maybe I'll find out why they kicked you. I'll tell you if I hear anything okay. Okay, thank you. Anytime. Thank you for getting rid of her, babe. Anything for you? You have no idea how much this mean to me, number three. Um, hum. Your friend Mad Max here has joined the experience. You two are so full of gross. Excuse me? Shut up. Don't talk to her like that, bro. Or what? Man, I don't want any trouble. What's up? Did something happen? You're damn right something happened. What? Why did you block Jane? Why did you kick her from the chat? I told you she left herself and I didn't block her. Yeah, nonsense. She told me so herself. Look. She was all over Connor and I didn't need any temptations. For him to worry about plus, she's a bad girl anyway. She isn't even into you so stop defending her. You're such a pushover. Temptations? Pushovers? Yes, temptations. You cannot control yourself and I can tell. So I did what I had to. And yes, pushover? She's just a dirty girl. Tommy, hopping, she doesn't care about you. Get over it. You don't deserve his love, Maddie. Connor, I hope you open your eyes and realize she's a self-absorbed who hardly in love with you and more in love with the idea of you. LMAO, what a crybaby. Get the hell off me. What? You heard me. Get off. Boo. Now. What's gotten into? You, Maddie, don't even start. Stop it. You're scaring me. Yeah, I'm scaring you. Yes, stop. Well, you didn't seem so scared a minute ago, telling me I can't control myself. God, you're so dramatic. Get over it. It's not even that harsh. I shouldn't have listened to you. What? Jane didn't deserve being blocked. I should have blocked you instead. No, baby. Just in case you didn't get the memo or over. 
O V E R. Was that clear enough? Now get TF out of my life, you little girl. Time to change my user at no aim and find Jane. Much better. Now the bio. There. Now back to the group chat to kick Maddie. Block her and add Jane back Jane and unblock her. Connor has kicked Maddie 777 from the group. What the hell? Nila, Nila shut, up. shut up. Geese okay. Hey, wait a minute. Where'd Jane go? Oh my, oh god. my god. Anyways. Connor has added Janie to the group. Guys. My messages they're sending again. Hey, Jane. Shut up. Slay. Can we talk? No. But I need tell you. Tough. Max, can you tell Jane I'm sorry? Connor says he's sorry. Tell him to shut up. Jane says shut up. Tell Jane to stop being childish and talk to me. Connor says. What do you want? I'm sorry. Whatever. I'm really, really sorry. Not cutting it. Janie, I'm super sorry and I shouldn't have listened to Maddie. Because she's toxic and insecure and you're my best friend over. And I'm so happy and you're the bestest and coolest and... Okay, enough. I forgive you. Really? No. God, I'm joking, yes. I really forgive you. Good. Janie, can you DM me? Yeah, sure. Nilla, cut it out. Have fun, guy. Nilla, seriously. Someone's jealous. So what's up? Look, Jane, I've been trying to hide it, but I just can't anymore. Hmm? I like you. Oh. No, I'm sorry you just caught me off guard. Jane, if you don't feel the same. No. No. No, you don't feel the same? No, I do. You don't have to pretend. I like you too, Max. Okay. But. But? But maybe we shouldn't, you know, date. Date? Not publicly. We can, um, still be closed. Jane, what's going on? I'm scared. Scared? What of? It's gonna sound stupid. Tell me. Hmm. This isn't about what happened with Connor and Maddie, is it? No. Jane. Yes, I just don't want us to try now into them. We won't. How do you know? I don't. But I know that I'm yours and I'd hope that you're mine. So? So that's enough to keep us us. Okay. 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 We can be a thing you know. I am yours if you're not ready to be mine. I'll wait for you. No, I want to be yours now. Okay, good three. How'd it go, you two? Nilla. That was a serious question. It went well. Okay, what's going on with you guys? Well, Max and I are. Together. Finally, took y'all long enough. Congrats. Are you okay, Connor? He's fine, just jelly you. Connor kicked Nilao Mao from the chat. Bro. Hard for Jane added Nilao Mao to the group. Y'all just started dating and already got matching users. Yes? So what? Nothing, just don't get your hopes up. What is your problem? What's yours? T. You just met him and you're already dating. I didn't just meet him and God. Why do you care so much? Because he likes you. Because I know what you deserve and I don't think you should settle for him. You know nothing about me. Only because you left me were kids. Shut up. Fine. Fine. Offline. Jesus. He likes her, doesn't he? Well, no. Hom. I wouldn't be worried if I were you. Nothing has happened between them recently. Recently? Oh, he didn't tell you? Jane, you be so good at this game. Thank you, Connor. You are so nice. I'm Janie. Yes? I kind of like you. I like you too, Connor. You are my bestie. No, I like like you. Oh. Do you like like me? Yes, of course. But I thought we were best friends. We can still be best friends. Really? Yes. Yay. I love you, Janie. I will never hurt you. Ah, ha ha. I love you, Connor. So yeah, that's basically what happened. Wow. I'm surprised Connor didn't say anything about it to you. I'm surprised Jane didn't. Eh, I mean she must just not remember? You think? Nah, but she probs just doesn't care. What? Oh please, they were kids. They didn't even understand what they were doing. Yeah, you're right. Well, obviously, I'm right. Shut up. Whatever. Hey, babe. Hey. Are you okay? What's wrong? Jane, I'm fine. Shut up. No, you're not. What happened? Did you and Connor date? No. Jane. I mean, in some ways, yes. But in my mind, no. What? Well, in 2019. No, I've already heard the story. Huh? 
Nyla told me Connor told her. Oh well, then you already know that we were kids and it didn't matter. Wait, does it matter to you? Is there still something there between you two? No you. Never. You sure? Because he get real jealous. There is nothing going on between us, Max. There never was it was just kids stuff. I promise. All right. All right. Connor. Jane. Cut it out, both of you. He started it. Me? Yes. But you two are so childish. Well, we did grow up together until she left. You're so ridiculous. You know you love me. What the hell, bro? Hum. She doesn't love you. She never will. Yo, what are you on about? Who cares if you've known her longer? She chose me. Me. So get over it. Um. I'm sorry, Jane. I'm not comfortable with him here. What? Block him, please. What? Me or him. You have to choose Jane. Bro, chill. Shut up, Connor. God, shut up. I am not choosing between my love, ring my best friend. You guys are ridiculous. Call Medge 4, Ni has left the group. At her back. Call Medge 4, Ni cannot be added to the group. Bro, I'm not playing at her back now. I can't. Why not? If I knew I wouldn't like this, would I? Shut up and add her back. I can't. You add her. Call Medge 4, Ni cannot be added to the group. Bro, why can't I add her? What's going on? I'm gonna try mean her. Jane Jane, are you getting these? Why isn't your name showing? Why aren't you replying? Okay, drop the act, haha. Good joke now, stop. User call medge for knee has been deleted. What? What happens? She's gone. Yo, man, that's not a funny joke. It's not a joke. I'm serious. She deleted her account. You lying piece of. No, he's telling the truth, Max. I can't find her user. This is all your fault. My fault? Yes. You've got this all wrong, bro. You made her choose. You may be the bad guy. You are the reason she's gone, not me. You're acting like Maddie. Maybe you should look into a future with her. All right. That's enough. If you think you're so innocent, then leave. I will. Yeah, and you claim to care about her. Look at you running now. You never cared for her. So pathetic giving up on her. Are you kidding? I'm not giving up on her. I've watched her to leave before. It wasn't anything like this. She's not coming back, man. She's gone. And BTW, bro, I love that girl more than you could ever imagine. Hello. I'm gonna delete I'm this game and May find her IRL. User Connor has been deleted. What a liar. He didn't lie. What? He loved her. He I'm always has, he always will. I mean, I that story was a little but sus to me. I know, right? Okay. But there's no proof. Ugh, why you always? I'm so sorry, Maddie. My name is Madison. We're not that close. I'm so sorry. Ugh, forget it. So stupid. She's so beautiful. I wish I could make her mine. Maybe I should try that thing. After school, it is a shop. Hi. Hi. How can I help you? I've heard that there's a thing here that can help me. Let me guess. You want to make a person love you? How do you know? That's not something that I can explain to you. Okay, so what do you have for me? I don't have love potion, but I have this pill. What can it do? If the girl in your dream take this pill, her mind will become a blank in about 10 minutes. What can I do with that 10 minutes? Just let me finish. In that 10 minutes, you can tell her anything. She will believe it. For real? I have 10 minutes to recreate her memories. Yes. Shut up and take my money. How much do you have? Well, you sell it. You tell me how much for it. Our products are not in listed price. We only take cash. You have to pay me with all the cash you have in your pocket right now. I have only $40. Then that will be all I need. Okay, here. Before I give this pill to you, I want you to know there's a warning. You need to make up a reasonable lie, or else she will realize the truth easily. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Give me that. Now, now I need, I to, need come to come up with, with a plan, plan for her, for her, her to, to take, take this, this pill. pill. The next day at school! There she is. Oh, she's wearing a new bag. I should spill this coffee on her bag. Oh my freaking god, what's wrong with you? This is my new bag. Are you blind or something? I am so, so, so sorry. How much is this bag? Ugh, I don't want to be a bad guy, so listen. Please stay away from me. If you see me anywhere, go another way, got it? I understand, but can I pay for the bag? I want to do something. No need. Just please leave us alone. It's not a too expensive bag, but you don't seem like someone can pay for it. Lucky for you, she is generous. Maybe I can eye you a coffee. I said I don't need anything. I can do anything. Maybe I can be your slave for a day. I can do chores. You are so pathetic. But wait, I really need someone to clean my room. Yeah, yeah, I can do it. 
Huh? If you want to do it so bad. Yeah, I want to do it. Okay, then come with me to my house after school. Okay, thank you. I mean for giving me a chance to apologize. Whatever. Nice. After school, at Madison's house. Okay, here's my room. I need you to clean everything. And don't you dare to steal something or do something creepy in here. Got it. Axel cleans Madison's room in two hours. Well done, I should go downstairs to tell her. Wait, I almost forgot the reason why I'm here. Okay, she has a bottle of water in here. I'll put the pill in there. Yeah, you are. Hey, have you done? Oh, yes, I have. So nice. I was about to go find Thank you and tell you. Okay, Goodbye. now leave. Your voice sounds weird. Is that because you have been talking on the phone for two hours straight? For real, it sounds weird. Yeah, maybe have some water. Let's see if it helps. Okay. Now try to speak again. Wow. Maddie? Hello? Nice, mm. the pill has worked. Okay, listen, Maddie, you love me so much. And you asked me to be your boyfriend. Mm. I said yes. And now it. we are a happy couple. Of course, your friend Zoe doesn't like me, but you doesn't care about her. Maybe you will try to make her like me too as a friend, of course. Should I add something more? Oh, I am the one who understand you more than anyone. Well, maybe that's it. Now maybe I should just wait. Ten minutes later. Um, I feel like I has just gone numb for a second. Lol, my brain sometimes doesn't work, babe. What? What did you just call me? What? Are you joking with me now? You are my babe, duh. Oh, right. Ah, oh, you must be tired now, baby. Yeah, do you want to stay over tonight? Why? Because I miss you. I feel like I haven't met you for ages. Hum, somehow I forgot. How long have we been dating? We haven't celebrated an anniversary, right? Yeah, we have been dating for three months. Anyway, I can't stay over tonight. I need to go see you tomorrow at school. Wait. OMG, I can't believe it worked. She's now mine forever. I'm so happy. My heart is pounding. The next day. Hey, babe. Oh, hi. What? Babe. Uh, Zoe, I know you don't like Axel, but he's my boyfriend now, okay? Since when? Since three months ago. What the? Look, be nice to him, okay? What the hell is going on now? Babe, I want to see you after school. Of course. Anything for my girl. What happened yesterday at your house? Nothing. Axel just helped me to clean my room. This is so crazy. Girl, you are crazy. Shut up, Zoe. You were annoyed by him yesterday. Now looking at you, calling him babe and stuffs. Are you even sober? I have never been mean to him. I love him. Are you? Ugh, I can't. Shoot, will she make Maddie realize? I'm out of here. I'll talk to you later. I am so sorry, babe. I never want you to experience this. It's okay. I don't why Zoe doesn't like you. Well, don't worry. I'll make her like you one day. Yeah, let's go to class. Later that day? Maddie girl, I need to talk to you. What? What happened yesterday? Did Axel do something to you when I was at your house? What do you mean? He's a gentleman. I doubt that. Look, I asked him to stay the night. He said no. Wow, you asked him to stay the night? Girl, there is definitely something is wrong with your brain. Excuse me. You have never liked him. Well, clearly you don't know me that well. Hi, girls. Hi, Otis. Hi. I would love to talk to you guys, but I have to find my boyfriend. What? Don't act so surprised, Otis. Is she being real? She has a boyfriend now? Um. Can you tell me what's going on? I thought that there's something between us. I know, Ugh. She likes you. But clearly she has a boyfriend now, and who even is that? Do I know him? It's Axel. What? I thought she doesn't like him. He's the weird and clumsy guy who is always bumps into her and spills things. Yeah, that Axel. This doesn't make any sense. Okay, now you see the problem. I need your help. Help what? Yesterday, Axel spilled his coffee all over Maddie's bag. I know that. Yeah, and he wanted to do something about that, like pay her back or something. But Maddie said no need. Okay. But he insisted. Weird. I know, right? He said he would do anything, and she was like, I need someone to clean my room. He was happy to do it. Dang, and after he cleaned her room, she behaved like this? Exactly. You understand the situation now. He must have done something to her. How was your day? Not so good. What happened? Nothing. It's just we're not in the same class. And that make me feel sad. Oh, baby. Should I switch class? No, it's fine. I'll make sure to spend time with you every day. You promise? I promise. I just feel like we have never actually spent time to each other. Stop thinking about that, baby. It's different now. Do you want to go to my house after school? Of course. Few months later. Hey, you know what? What? Willow is back in town. Oh, really? Why didn't she tell me? I think you should ask her that in person. That's weird. She always tells me when he's back visiting us. 
at a cafe. Hi, Willow. Hello. Um, who is this? I want to introduce you. This is my boyfriend, Axel. Axel, I thought you hate this boy. What are you talking about? I love him. Um, babe, who is this? Oh, I'm sorry. This is my best friend since childhood. Her name is Willow. I thought Zoe is. Yeah, Zoe knows Willow too. OMG, I tell Willow everything that happens in my life. Even when she had moved away. We still talk every day. Hmm, that's why I am here, Maddie. You haven't texted me for months. What? Yeah, right. Why haven't I texted you? Ugh, I have a slightly headache. And Zoe has told me that you're really, really weird lately. Ugh, it's because she doesn't like Axel. But she likes everyone you like, remember? I know, right? She acts like I have never told her I like Axel. Have I told her that? Um, I think you're having a bad headache, babe. Sorry, but I think we should go. Why so hurry? I, I mean, we have to go. Let's go, babe. Yeah, I think I should take a nap when we reach home. You should drink more water, too. Goodbye, Willie. Bye, Maddie. Yeah, I think you are right. That Axel boy is very shady. He is so creepy, isn't he? Not creepy to me, more like a pathetic dude. He's taking Maddie home. I think you should keep an eye on him. Got it. Baby, will you stay with me? I'm so sorry, but I think I have to go if something came up. No, I want you to be here with me. Sh take a nap and I'll make it up for you tomorrow, okay? Promise. Promise. I need to ask you something. Oh, hi, my old friend. I'm not your old friend. I bought a pill here once. Of course, I remember you. Now, what's become your trouble? I think I have made a small mistake. I didn't know she has another best friend. And that best friend is talking things that makes her headache. Oh, bro, I've warned you. You should make up a reasonable lie. What do you mean? I just told her that she loved me and wanted me. But without the pill, does she likes you? Do her friends like you? No. Yeah, you could have bought pills for all her friends. Or tell her that you're starting to love me, right? Shut up. Now what can I do now? Can I buy two more pills? Can't. Someone came and bought all of them. Must be a smart one. Well, come back in two days and make sure your girl won't get any more headaches. Headaches mean she's confusing or realizing something. At Maddie's house? Who's there? Um, why are you here? We need to talk. Um, okay. Are you sure that you love Axel? I if you want to talk shit about him again, please leave. I still have those texts you send me and tell me you hate a boy whose name is Axel. Remember the bag that Axel spilled coffee on? Remember how angry you were then? We were having something, remember? More specific, bro. Um, I like you and you like me too, I guess. Ouch, my head. Anyway, can I ask who bought all of the pills? You know them. You mean, shoot. Baby, what is? Babe. Thanks, God. Baby, what? That's what I have been calling you. WDF, you're late. We've helped her to bring back her memories. You should have listened to the seller's warning. Ugh, you disgusting, filthy little shit. To make sure Axel wouldn't do the same anymore, they forced him to take a pill and told him that he has never liked Maddie or known about the sus shop. Since Axel doesn't have any friends, no one can help you to remember what happened. About Madison, she has to see a therapist, just like Ezra's audience after watching Ezra's cringe Roblox story. The end. Cheryl, please wait. For what? You lied to me again. F you, I trusted you. Cheryl? I hate you. I'm guessing you know about this to Zach. What? Everyone know, huh? I really can't trust any of you. Cheryl, I was about to tell. Say that you are probably lying, too. Marina, Marina get, get to her, to her before, before, me. before me. Zach, why did you tell Marina? Cheryl never told me not to tell Marina. And it's not my fault for what you did. Whatever, man. What the hell is wrong with you, bro? Why, you don't know anything about what's going on, Zach? Oh, I don't. Well, Marina sure does. No, she doesn't. She only overheard a conversation that me and Leela had. To think you were doing all this shit without telling me. Come on, bro. Really? I don't care what your excuses are. What you did was messed up. You doing stupid shit like this is the reason we're dripping apart. You used to be like a brother to me. I don't know what happened to you now. Ouch. Now I'm gonna go talk to Chandler. I hope you end up regretting everything you've done. Dude. I never want to do this sheet in the first place. So then why did her? Just forget it. Exactly. How do I tell Selena? She will literally 
ruin everything for her if she finds out. Hey, Ren. I'm so happy to see you. I'm sure you already know why I'm here. So do you. Of course you do, you pathetic beach. You couldn't even do one thing for me. How did you find out? I told her. The deal is off. I'm telling Zack everything, including what my side of the deal was. No, Selena, I swear, you will ruin everything. Not my problem. It was a part of the deal. Bye. Happy. Honestly, I'm happy that you told Skylar because I wouldn't have been able to. Why is that? I don't know. I guess I was enjoying pretending to date her a little too much. What's that supposed to mean? You like her or something? Maybe. Maybe not. But listen here, you little prick. You better stop acting like you know. What the hell is going on? Sure, you know about the deal, but you know absolutely nothing about the backstory. The only person who knew about it was Selena. But now, because of you, she's about to tell Zack about it. And once he finds out, he's gonna hate me. How about you make some actual friend and stop faking with us, Marina? You like someone who hates you. That's embarrassing. Who said I liked her? Love. I said maybe. That doesn't mean anything. I may not know your backstory or anything, but I know for a fact you like her. Her? I don't blame her for hating me at the moment, but I'm gonna tell her everything so she hears it from me with the full story instead of your noisy ass. But she already heard it from me. No. She you think that everything is over now? Besides... I've been friends with Zack, Cheryl, and Selena for over two years. You think I'm just gonna let you waltz in and ruin everything? That's funny. Have fun trying, sweetheart. Have fun trying to make her forgive you, sweetheart. Oh my lord, stop following me. I don't want to talk right now. Why are you mad at me? I didn't do anything. Don't forget who warned you about liking and dating Renja. Yeah, you forgot about that, didn't you? I found out about the deal right before you did. Zack, I'm sorry. I'm just so angry and hurt. I've been friends with Selena for over a year and she just does this to me without an explanation too. I'm humiliated and I feel stupid. I've been so blind. Even after you warned me many times. You were there for me when nobody else was. Even Selena. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't be. Your friends just betrayed you. Of course you're gonna be angry. And I'll always be here. That's what friends are for, right? Right? Hey, Jay, can I borrow you for a sec? I need to tell you something. Selena, please leave. I don't even know if I want to talk to you right now. Oh, come on. It'll just be for a few minutes. Whatever. Cheryl, I'll be back soon. Okay, what? Just a few things. Why are you mad at me for what I did to Cheryl? Why does she concern you? Because she's my friend. But you're being more loyal to her than to me. Are you losing furangs for me? Do you like her? What, no? I'm mad because I don't even know you anymore when we first dated. You were a completely different person than you are now. You were happy and kind. You were always filled with energy and you were someone I could turn to. Now ever since we've been hanging out with Cheryl, you've been acting different. As if you have something against her. I never thought you'd do something like this to your own best friend. But who knows? And I just get this fearing that you're hiding things from me. It's very aggravating. And I sometimes feel like it's my fault. Selena, I can't be with someone rude and selfish. You're acting like Ren. Excuse me. So what? You're breaking up with me for hurting Cheryl? You know what? You're just like a mirror. Cheryl? Cheryl Cheryl? It's always about Cheryl. It's always gonna be Cheryl. Cheryl fucking hurt me. Cheryl freaking hurt me. I have my reasons for what I did. Oh geez, I wonder why. I don't know about that. Maybe it's cause you don't tell me. Sheet. All right, look, I'm gonna tell you everything. Then can we start over? I'll change for you, I promise. I don't know. Come on, please. I need, I to, need tell to tell him either, either way. way. Fine. This is your last straw, though. Got it. Don't disappoint me any more than you already have. Yes. Thank you so much. I love you. You're not up to anything, are you? Of course not. I like you too much anyways. Okay, now tell me everything. Don't leave anything out. Okay, if you say so. This is what Ren gets? Well, it started months ago. I wonder what they're talking about. What could she possibly want this time? I'll never forgive her. I mean, seriously. What did I even do to her? Cheryl, please listen. I can't get myself involved with you anymore, Ren. You've heard me enough. 
And you want to know the sad part. I still like you. I can't get over you, Renja. And it's killing me. That's why I can't be around you anymore. I'll get too attached. I can't get attached to someone who hurt me. So please, just leave me alone. Cheryl. Didn't you hear me? I said leave. Cheryl, just listen to me, please. Please, you can ignore me for the rest of your life after, if you want. You are so difficult, you know that. Okay, well, I just wanted to tell you the full story. You deserve to know. After what happened to you, the last person I wanted you to find this out from was Marina. But look at what happened. Anyways, this all started when Zack and Selena started dating. They started dating around three months ago. But even before they were dating, I had a girlfriend of my own. Her name was Marina. And she was my world. She was the light in my darkness. The best girlfriend I could ever ask for. We've been dating longer than Selena and Zack dated. So over a year. Wait, Marina. I was friend with her. Yeah, me and you have met before, but I'm guessing you forgot. You weren't around at the time. So it was just me, Selena, Zach, and Marina. Zach and Selena have been dating for a week at the time. We were a perfect friend group until Zach started acting weird. Zach, are you okay? Yeah, don't worry. Fast forward two weeks. It didn't get any better, her. Hi. Hey. Guys, do you want to do something? Nah. Oh, okay. So one day, I just had enough. Z, can we talk? I'm good. Dude, I'm being serious. Bro, whatever. Talk to me. Stop being overdramatic. So annoying. Fine. Let's go. Okay. What? What's up with you? Why are you acting off? No clue what you're talking about. Are you freaking kidding me? Bro, hop off. I'm fine. That's bullshit. Just tell me, you can talk to me, Dude, out of everyone, I'm probably the most worried about you. Okay, but you better not tell anyone, not even Selena or Marina. I'm serious. Okay, I promise. Just tell me, you can trust me. Then he told me a bunch of personal sheet. I'm not gonna say what he said because he trusted me. I can't make the same mistake I once made. Zach. Hi. Everyone, Thanks for listening, man. It helped Today, me. It felt good to get that out. I never cream. want if you, you like to feel it, alone. Like. You can always talk to me. Don't bottle up your emotions like that. Okay, but I'm trusting you. Ren, please don't tell anyone. Don't worry. I would never. I really appreciate it. I'm gonna go now. All right. Right, man. Later. Ren, what did he tell you? Don't worry about it. I'm being serious. Tell me or else. I'm listening. It would be a shame if Marina just broke up with you, wouldn't it? It I would, but she doesn't have a reason to. Yeah, not yet. The hell is that supposed to mean? You realize me, her and Cheryl have been friends for longer than you do have been dating. Isn't Cheryl the girl I've seen around Marina? I haven't seen her around you, though, anymore. I wonder why. Don't worry about it, a show. Are you mad at her? Her or something. Didn't you just hear me? Don't go changing the subject. Marina will believe anything I say. She wouldn't think I'm lying to her. Her, her. I can easily break you two up unless you tell me what Zach told you, of course. Ask him yourself. Just tell me what he said. Not a chance, Selena. I'm his girlfriend. I deserve to know. Maybe try being patient with him. Then he'll tell you. You guys have only been dating for a week. Calm down. Okay. I guess you don't care if you and Marina break up then. Yeah, right. Go ahead and try. We've been dating for a long time for a reason. Selena, you can't break the trust we build up during that time. Only one way to find out, then. What the hell has gotten into her? To be completely honest, I wasn't worried at all. I knew Marina wouldn't let one punny lie ruin us. Well, at least I thought it was the next day when everything went downhill. Thank you, Jody. Hey, see? How are you feeling? Much better. Ren. Hi, Marina. We need to talk. Someone's grumpy. Dude, shut up. Oh, come on. I was joking. 
Are you all right? We always joke around. I just said we need to talk, didn't I? So obviously not. Oh, all right. I'm sorry, Zack. I'll be back. Dang. What's wrong, Luff? Last night, Selena told me a bunch of shit about you and what you've been doing behind my back. I'm honestly so disgusted in you, Ren. Like, what the hell? Oh, oh shit. shit. I, forgot I forgot about the, about the Selena, Selena situation. situation. What did she tell you? She told me not to tell you, so I won't. But either way, you already know what you did. You're seriously gonna believe her, huh? You are telling me I shouldn't trust my own best friend. But you shouldn't trust the person you've been dating for over a year. Seriously, I have no clue what she told you, but... I swear she's lying. You think I would willingly throw away our relationship after so long? All of the memories we've made and the bond we've built. I'm sorry, Ren, but I trust Selena with all my heart. She's my best friend. So you're just gonna leave? Like that with no hesitation? After all we've been through? Are you kidding me? Please, I can't lose you. Goodbye, Ren. And just like that, I never saw her again. Isn't it funny how fast someone can become a stranger to you? I don't know what Selena did or how she pulled it off, but she somehow broke us apart after I was confident she wouldn't be able to. How stupid of me. Right. But even so, I didn't regret a thing. I mean, what did Selena want me to do? Betrayed Zack for her reasons. I mean, sure, Marina meant the world to me. I loved her with all my heart, and she gave me an experience with love I've never had before. But Zack, he was my best friend. He's always been by my side and he's always been there for me. He was like my brother, but I made a mistake. Wow, that's awesome. Hi. Man, what the hell? What the hell? Selena, you're the most self-centered bitch on the planet. I so hope you yummy. know that. We've been friends for so long, and you just go... And do this to me because I didn't go behind my friend's back. What the hell has gotten into you? Oh, come on, Ren. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. You just ruined my relationship. I've been friends with Selena for a long time as well. And I never expected that she would do this to me. Look, I'm sorry, but I certainly know how to fix this. Knowing you, it's probably something bad. I can go and tell Marina that I was lying and you have your precious relationship back. And in return, you tell me what Zack said. Simple. Wouldn't she be mad at you? Probably. But it's not like I care. She was annoying anyways. So are you in or not? Did I really want to get back with a girl who didn't really trust me? No, my answer would definitely be no. But at the time, my answer was different. I loved her. And I wasn't ready to be broken up with her. And so right then and there, I made the worst mistake. I don't regret a lot of things, but I definitely regret this. Okay, fine. But you better not tell him, Selena. He will hate me. Okay, okay. Just tell me. And so I told her. Okay, I've done my part. It's your turn now. Okay. She then informed me that Marina wasn't ready to get back together. Which means, I told her for nothing. It made no sense because she knew at that time never did whatever Selena told her I did. I had so many questions for her, but I've never seen her since. With everything that has been Where's going on, I started to change and act Stop. differently. I and I know, Zack doesn't like the person I've become, but no matter what he thinks of me now, I can't let him go and I won't. He will always be like a brother to me. Sure, I messed up and I'm ashamed of it. I did it all for Marina, and now I'm doing this all for Zack. Doing what for Zack? This stupid deal. Selena decided to use the information about C I gave her against me. The deal was that if I made you fall for me and then completely break your heart, then Selena wouldn't tell Zack that I told her what he trusted me with. But it doesn't matter now. Because Selena is telling him at this very moment, everything will be ruined. You said you didn't regret it. So why did you end up telling Selena? I was so angry with Selena that I didn't realize how hard it would be without Marina. I didn't regret it because Z is my best friend. But at the same time, 
I missed her a lot. It all happened so fast. I just wasn't ready to let everything go. So I told Selena, hoping Marina would get back with me. But look how that turned out. I didn't get her back. And now, I'm about to lose my best friend. I hate myself. He trusted me. Do you miss her? Of course. But when Selena told me that I have to make her friend fall for me, I didn't have a problem with it. That wasn't until I actually saw who you were. I knew you were friends with Arya. And so you reminded me of her. I just kept thinking of her whenever I was with you. And I hated it. I then wanted to back out. I didn't want to do it. But I then remembered, I am doing this for Zack. So I, I just dealt with it. Jam. But no matter how much I hated being around you because of it, I couldn't help but actually fall for you somewhere in the process of this deal. I couldn't tell Selena. I knew she'd be furious. I knew she's lost someone special to her as well. I couldn't do her like that. Wait, she did. Who? Her ex-boyfriend, Daniel. Oh, right. She never told me why they broke up and began to ghost me, too. That's why I wasn't around when you four were a group. I was only ever with Marina. Me and Lila were still friends, but she just never talked to me. And when we did, she would be very dry and rude. So I just stopped putting in the effort. But whatever the reason was for her doing so, I guess she eventually got over it because she spoke to me again. You don't know anything about their breakup. Should it? Kind of. Especially since you're the reason. Wait, what? Well, no. I think it was because of Daniel. But Selena thinks differently. Look, you need to talk to Selena. Excuse me? After what she did to me? Hell, no. Well, I was behind it too. But you're talking to me, aren't you? Well, yeah. But you have a reason. Don't try to defend me for what I did to you. It was wrong. And although I had, so did Selena. She did. It all depends on how you look at it. But she didn't do this for no reason. But she didn't tell you anything. That's why you don't know. And that's also why you need to talk to her. So you guys can clear things up and you can get answers. Answers? I don't know. Oh, come on. It won't be bad. I promise. Speak your mind. Tell her. How you actually feel about things, and if things get heated, then just leave. Okay, I'll go with you. But Zack. Don't worry, I'm prepared for whatever he has to say, say. Okay. So yeah, that's the story. What the hell do you guys want? Selena, we need to talk. No, we don't. Lay, you can't just do something like this to me and expect me to not want to talk to you. How about you grow the fuck up and have a conversation with me? Whatever. Later though. Later. Are you fucking kidding me? Right now? Fine, let's go. Zack, Zack, I'm sorry. You what? Sorry, for telling Selena all my personal issues and my mental state. Oh yeah, don't worry, it's fine. Not a big deal at all. Zack, you know why I did it. Hey Selena, I'm back. Huh, where did she go? OMG, Ren. What the hell? Is that really you? Who are huh? Delicious. What do you mean? It's me, Marina. No, I mean, who actually are you? I already told you, I'm Marina. Would you stop playing dumb? You're not my Marina. His, His Marina. Marina. Yes, I am. What the hell are you doing here? Jeez, how about a hello? I'll say whatever I want. Well, to answer your question, me and Selena have been friends. We never stopped. I guess Selena didn't tell you. Oh, well, that's your problem. This, this just, just messed, messed my, my whole mood up. I was with Selena, but I guess she's not here anymore. Look at who I found instead. Fate must hate me for running me into you. You're not doing anything with that attitude, so cut it. If you really want the attention you're desperately seeking for, go elsewhere. I'm used to your games, love. You're used to my games. You broke my heart. If anyone is used to games, that would be me. Oh, stop victimizing yourself, Marina. I didn't do anything to you. Selena even told you I didn't do any of that stuff, and you still didn't get back with me. You let Selena ruin our relationship. If you didn't trust me that much, you should have never dated me. What do you mean you didn't do any of that stuff? Yes, you know that. 
Well, that's most certainly not what Selena told. Huh, what do you mean? Well, after I left you, Selena joined me again. Hey. What's up? Well, I know you're sad from what happened with Ren, but I have something else to tell. Okay, okay, what is it? Well, I was just with Renja and he wanted me to tell you something. He said that he's happy that you guys are over and he never even liked you anyways. Oh, so you're telling me he cheated on me with many different girls. Then he said that about me? Yeah, Ren does that all the time. He's cheated on many girls before. He also said that you're just a side chick. What? Why didn't you tell me that he cheats a lot? Why didn't you warn me? You're saying it's my responsibility to make sure that you are in a happy relationship. No, but I would never let a cheater date you. I would say something. Look, I thought he changed. I didn't want you to worry, but I guess not. I'm really sorry. It's whatever. Can I be alone? Oh, yeah. Marina isn't ready to get back together. So you broke my heart, asshole. That's not what happened, at all. Oh, is this another one of your lies? The fact you mean, another? I never lied to you. It's your friend. That's the issue here. She's the only one who's been lying. Here's what actually happened. He tells the story. That's the truth. I don't care if you believe me or not at this point. Jeez, it's like you don't care about me anymore. Marina, we've been over for a long time. Only three months. That's pretty long to me. Yeah, to you. Look, I'm sorry, okay? Something, Something tells, tells me, me that, that I, should I should just, just believe, believe him. him. He, has he has no, no reason, reason to, lie. to lie. I shouldn't have left you like that. I should have talked it out with you. I didn't handle it well, I'll admit that. But I didn't know what Selena would have thought if I stayed with you. And I regret it so much now. I'm sorry, okay? I still like you. I like you a lot. I miss everything about you. If you give me another chance, you won't regret it. Marina, please. I love you. Can you give me some time? Yeah, bye. Dude, seriously. What? You better not. Whatever. She threw us off track. Right. Anyways, as I was saying, you know why I did it. Yeah, for a girl who left hey, you in you less okay, than five so minutes. Big. Dang. Look, I'm uh -huh. mad at you, this but I also see where you're coming from. Selena screwed you over. She didn't even tell Let's Marina what she was supposed to after you told her. But what you did still doesn't sit right with me. I know. I'm sorry. I was just so confused and upset. I didn't know what to do. You screen. were an amazing friend and just an amazing person in general. You've always been good to me and always had my back. I am no longer worthy of your trust and I'll accept that. But listen to me, whether you forgive me or not, for whatever happens to our friendship, I will always have your back, just like you've always had mine. I may not show it, but I care about you a lot. You're my number one, right? My brother. Always have, always will be. I'll give you some time to think later, huh? He's too much, but that's why he's my best friend, because I can put up with it. All right. What did you want to talk about? Literally about everything that's been going on. Like why you made Ren fall for me. Then break my heart. Like, seriously? You must be at a really low point in your life to find satisfaction from watching me getting hurt. Why the hell would you do this to me, Selena? Honestly, F you. Bring I've always been there for you. Earlier. And this is how you repay me. Ding. Well, I have nothing to say. So you're just really wasting your time. Tell me why you did it, Selena. Ren told me why he did it. But why did you do it? See, Renja told me you had your reasons, but I'm beginning to think it's all just an excuse. I don't have to tell you. Plus, what will you do if I don't? I'm gonna blackmail you. What? No, uh -huh, this just kidding. I'm years. nothing like you. Thankfully, just tell me, Selena. Fine. You really wanna know? Well, here it is. She tells the story. Selena, why didn't you tell me about this? I don't know. I didn't want you to know my boyfriend caught feelings for you, I guess. So instead, you ghost me. Do you know how many times I've cried because of that? It wasn't even my fault. It kind of was, though. You think I can control who Daniel liked? Is that what you're saying? You were probably flirting with him or something. Are you kidding me? Not in any way have I done anything to make him fall for me. It's sad that you're blaming me instead of your boyfriend. Can't you see? 
that he was the problem. Nothing was his fault. He was a gentle, loyal, amazing, caring man and you took him away from me. That's his fault. You think I would intentionally ruin your relationship? Is nice. that seriously how low you think of me? You think I'm a faking homewrecker? Silly now? Look, I'm sorry for what you went through, but I'm not gonna sit here and take the blame. The fact that you don't think it's his fault in any Let's way is just it unhealthy. It's sad. I care about you, Selena. That's why I want you to open your eyes. Okay, it's obvious you loved him too much to blame him. Even though your actions Once were messed up, you did it all because you were hurt. But I still have questions. Why did you do all of this instead of just talking it out with me? You were being so immature. For what? I wanted you to see what it felt like to be heartbroken. I didn't like how I was the one heartbroken. Because he caught few rungs for you, okay. But you're doing this because of Daniel. Did you not get over him? Renja told me how you got with Zack to forget about Daniel. But you acted like you genuinely cared for Zack. You blackmailed Renja to see why Zack was upset. That shows that you care about him. In my opinion, at least. Yes, I do care about Zack. And I'm not just saying that he was there for me when Daniel wasn't. When I was heartbroken, I was super happy with Zack, but I was still not fully over Daniel. I still thought about him every day I got with Zack, hoping the thought of Daniel would vanish. When now I was with Zack, I realized he showed me that Daniel never fully showed a good relationship. I don't know why I was so obsessed with Daniel. Zack was a better boyfriend than he was, but I've been with Daniel for a year. It's hard to let that go. Daniel was Where's a good boyfriend, but not in any way did he beat Zack. I knew Zack would never leave me for one of my friends for no reason. So you may think I didn't actually like being with Zack, but I actually really did. But no matter how much I liked him, I was still angry. Not at him or Daniel, but you. I was angry at you. I couldn't help it. So, yeah, there's your answer. Are we done now? Oh, hey, Zack. Selena, we need to talk. Oh, okay. Now, 